Hello children, I am sure you all are good, healthy and enjoy your online classes, right? So today here I am with one more interesting activity of discovery. But before that I want to discuss with you something. You know the pandemic situation of coronavirus, yes? So to prevent against this virus, do you know uh, what uh, precaution I am taking? I use mask while going outside, I use sanitizer, I keep social distancing and one more important thing, I am having healthy food only, no more junk food, right? So nowadays in my diet, uh, mostly it includes uh, ginger, garlic and vitamin C enriched food like lemon, amla. Yes? So, uh, tell me children, uh, how uh, we get these all fruits and vegetables? Some of you will say, from market means, yes, you are right, but how does it come in market also? Yes, we get it from plants, our nature, right? So, today's our topic is plants and its you know children, our body has different parts like eyes, ears, hands, legs. Like that, plants also have different parts. Yes, so uh, the plant is mainly divided into two parts, shoot and root. The part which grows above the ground, it is called shoot and the part which grows Below the ground, it is called root. In shoot, it includes flower, leaf, seed, stem and fruit. And it root, it includes root only. Yes? So, now tell me children, which plant I am having with me? Yes, it is rose plant. You can see the beautiful red rose. Yes? So, let's see about the parts of this plant. You can see the flower. Then, here it is leaf. Then, can you see the small bird? It is a bird. And, it is stem. And, here it is having roots. Yes? So, now let's see more about roots. But tell me children, what is the function of roots? Roots hold the plant firmly in the ground. Roots absorb water and minerals from the ground and transport to the other parts of the plants. And some of roots like carrot, radish store food in them so that we can eat it. There are two types of roots, tap root and fibrous root. Let's see about tap root first. Many plants have one main root and small thin root grow from that main root. It is called tap root. The examples of tap root are carrot, radish, mustard and hibiscus. Now let's see about fibrous root. Some of plants do not have main root. They have thin and bushy roots uh, like this. It is called fibrous roots. The examples of fibrous roots are grass, onion, Got it? Now children, let's move towards today's activity which is based on tap root and fibrous root. Now children, let's start today's activity which is based on tap root and fibrous root. For this activity, you need discovery worksheet number 4. The unit name is plants around us. Pencil Caesar, Fevicol and Jute. 
small pieces of jute children if you don't get jute you can find another options for that like brown wool got it so children as you can see here you have to draw neat diagram of tap root and fibrous root as i have drawn here the diagram should be within this box so let's make first tap root for that you have to take this jute then take measurement of this main root like this like this and cut it with the help of the scissor children scissor is very sharp so please take help of your parents no problem this is our jute piece now what you will do please take out this small small jute pieces from this like this if you are getting difficulty in doing this please take help of your parents no problem children like this you have to take out jute pieces like this got it now apply some fevicol on this main root like this children you should use less amount of fevicol else your activity will get messy now stick this jute on this fevicol like this our main root is ready now let's do the small thin roots for that i have cut small pieces of jute like this again apply some fevicol on this main uh, side roots which grows from the main root you can apply fevicol together like this or one by one no problem children as per your convenience you can do it now stick that small jute pieces like this both sides we have to do like this again small small thin roots we are making now like this so our one side is ready now same you have to do this side also so our activity will look this is our main root and these are the small thin roots which grow from this main root this is the tap root now let's move towards fibrous root as you can see here i have already drawn diagram of fibrous root also now again you have to cut these small pieces of jute you can take measurement of these lines also then apply some fevicol on these lines like this and stick these jute pieces on that lines like this here also you can apply fevicol together or one by one 
बट प्लीज यूज लेस अमाउंट ऑफ फेविकॉल चिल्ड्रन देन यूर एक्टिविटी विल लुक नाइस वन बाय वन यू हैव टू स्टिक दिस स्मॉल रूट्स लाइक दिस नाउ आर फाइबरस रूट इज ऑल्सो रेडी फाइबरस रूट्स आर बंच और बुशी रूट्स लाइक दिस इट हैज नो मेन रूट यू कैन राइट एग्जाम्पल्स ऑफ फाइबरस रूट्स हियर लाइक like onion grass wheat right children so our tap root and fibrous roots activity is ready so children did you like today's activity i hope you enjoyed it yes so please be at your home be safe